When it was suggested I make a documentary about John, I must admit at first I felt uncomfortable, perhaps even prejudice. It was an instant reaction, I guess a, a normal reaction. I was nervous how I'd react. I wasn't used to being around people like him. Do you take sugar? I'm gonna have sugar. They always make that joke, don't they? I'm sweet enough already. No. Maybe they'll want to be a bit more sweeter. You know, so much anger in the world. What's wrong with a bit of sweetness? He wasn't at all what I expected. This is his story. A normal, inspiring man with a very unusual condition. Yeah, you know, I love going to the footy with the lads. It's the one thing um, that, you know, men, real men, of course, you can all do together, the singing, the shared emotion. There's nothing quite like it. When that goal goes into the back of the net, it's something that, you know, unites us. All together, sharing the glory, sharing the triumph. Ah, I love it. Not ashamed to say it, I love it. It's the best feeling in the world. Yeah, John's all right. He's one of the lads. Always gets his round in, doesn't he? Top bloke. Yeah, top bloke. If other people don't like him, fuck him. During the course of filming, John gave his unprecedented access to his friends and family. He said they could say what they like. What did he have to hide? Easy oh, as must be done. done. Too easy to Oh, you're alright, how's it going? You alright, right, John? <laughs> How you doing, son? Yeah, pretty good, pretty good. Oh, yeah, already started well. Yeah, yeah. Of course, because oh, we're forever bubbles. 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 Pretty bubbles in the air. They fly so high. Never reach the sky Like my dreams They fade and die Come on, Are you have Danny, 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 Danny Fucking cheers No one expects it to be their child, do they? But once you get told Then you soon get used to it We always knew there was something different about him even before we were definitely told, but he's still my boy. Okay, it's uh, Dad's birthday day then. I'm just uh, quickly uh, wrapping up a jumper, then uh, on my way over to surprise him. You know, it's, it's his birthday, so I'm sure he'll be expecting something, but yeah, it's nice to give him a bit of surprise. Yeah, and he does like his jumpers. What do you think of your brother? He's okay, I guess. I mean, you don't choose who your brother is, do you? Like, at school, yeah, definite embarrassment. I mean, I know he's trying to be supportive, but when he comes to netball, he thinks he's Brian Clough or Alex Ferguson shouting instructions. And people snigger, but what does he expect? Have you seen the shoes he wears? He dresses like a closing down sailor at Oxfam. Does he ever bring a girl home? A girl? <laughs> no. I mean, he doesn't notice them, does he? Maybe if she was wearing a West Ham shirt, he'd be excited. Do you wish he was born differently? No, he's my brother. He can't help his condition. And I love him. But he shouldn't use that as an excuse to be so damn annoying. No. Nice to dress up a bit. Hmm. Hopefully some of the rest of the family will be there as well. It'd be nice to have a catch up. Happy birthday, Dad! Oh, I just thanks so much. Oh, oh great. How are you doing? Oh, great. Oh, that's very great. Hat. Oh, you like it? Yeah. yeah. Just wow. warm in. <laughs> and it plays a tune. Surprise! Oh, brilliant. Can I open it now? Oh, of course, yeah. yeah you can. Yeah, yeah. So if I can. Oh, yeah. There's a... Well, whatever it is, yeah. Mm -hmm. so just go for it. I'll get it in there, hang on. What's done here? I'll wrap this up well. <laughs> oh, oh, thanks. A jumper. Yeah, well, yeah. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> Happy Hello. birthday to you. Oh, thanks so much. Happy birthday, dear daddy. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday to you. <laughs> Make a wish. Good. Make a wish. Oh, yes. Oh, I wouldn't have this for the world. There we go. Oh, lovely cake. John seemed to be trying really hard to appear normal. Perhaps a little too hard, I wondered. Next, he promised a boisterous night on the town. Look you sharp. Yes, of course. 
You know, I'm so happy, do it. It's got to be well in there. It's got to be well in there, look at it. We wouldn't want to go out of there. Oops, got a little giggle. Yeah, a little giggle. Looking promising. Looking promising. They're laughing. I see teeth. That's good, that's good. Excellent, yes. Oh, mate, he's coming back. What's happening, mate? I thought you were willing. Oh, that must be something I said, or I'm going to look or something. You're wearing d and mate. Don't be stupid. Nah, mate. Only one explanation. Lesbians! <laughs> Cheers, lads. For the first time, I saw John really isolated. In a bar full of people, he stood out as alone. Everyone else was relaxed, in love or laughing. But John was just sat there. When we got back, he went straight onto his computer. He had a determination in his eyes. I thought, is this some sordid world he's been keeping secret? The truth was far more innocent. We met uh, online through a dating site. It's, uh, I know people think that's a bit sad, but uh, it's funny you chat to someone online, you really you actually get to know them a bit first, which is good. Um, I, know, I know it sounds silly and old-fashioned, but I genuinely believe there is someone out there for everybody. And, well, you know, I've uh, chat uh, seen and uh, chatted to Kate a bit now, um, and, well, I don't like to get too excited, you know, but, um, well, I'm nervous, of course, but I, I hope she recognises me. John said we could film from a distance. He said he was nervous enough already without a camera following him. But I was curious. How would they get on? I stayed around, just in case they agreed to an interview. He's not the sort of guy I normally date, but yeah, he's nice. I was a bit nervous. I thought he might not like me. I think he did. <laughs> he even listened to me going on about tigers. I hope I didn't bore him. Do you think you'll see him again? So, uh, John. Yeah? John, did oh, you... Yeah. Quick interview? Yeah, you're oh, yeah, all right with that, so, yeah? yeah. Uh, how'd it go? How'd it go? Uh, really good, I think. It's actually really good. I, it's, uh, well, I, I'm quite excited. I'm sorry. You know, just well, just between ourselves, it's been uh, quite. It's been quite a long time since you know I've been, I've been out on a date. You know, it's, it, can, it can be hard to meet women. You know, but uh, you know, she she was really nice. I actually did. Well, you, you saw her at a distance. Did Did you not think she was nice? Yeah, yeah. She seems really sweet. Yeah, and she, she, she liked the roses, and she, she was interested. She uh, she didn't mind when I talked about our football. Um, well, she's really keen on animals. Hey, you know, so, Do you uh, think you're well matched? <laughs> well, maybe. Well, I, I don't don't want to. You know, it's just a first date. Do you think you she know? could be the one? Oh. <laughs> do, you, do you hope? Do you hope so? Well. Um, no, well, I, I, I don't want to go to say too much too far, you know. I don't want to jinx it or anything, but I do, I, 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 I do think she's really special. I'd love it if I could see her again, you know. Night, John. Good night. Our final day of filming, and last night seemed the perfect end. When I got there, I was shocked. I saw a different side of him. He was in the same clothes as the night before. It became clear he hadn't slept. He was convinced she'd never call.
Clearly, a life of prejudice had taken its toll on him. He asked me to stop filming. He said he felt he was showing himself in a bad light. A few days later, he called and agreed to one final. So how's it going? Um, yeah, good, thanks. Um, do you know what I heard, though? They might be scrapping Blue Peter. <laughs> How are we going to get our badges now? Anything else? Um, oh, yes. And you know what I read in the Metro? Hammers might be getting a new striker. That'd be good. We need to about time we'd had someone to bang in a few goals. I can't help worrying, though. I think we're still a bit too light at the back. But, well, we'll see. What about your date? Oh. That. I know that was ages ago. You know, it's just to try. <laughs> it's a good excuse not to see my mates' ugly faces for one night. Did you go to the zoo? Oh, no, not yet. I got a leaflet though. The, well, a couple. Depends what sort of animals you like, you know. Bit grander than a coffee in a, a, a cafe. Well, they have they have coffee cafes too. So, you're going to take her? Well, I, I don't know. I was thinking I might just play the field, you know? Uh, see who's out there. Me and the mates are heading the town tonight. Should be a laugh. I thought you liked her. Did you call? No answer. Oh, I sent a couple of texts, though. But she didn't reply. I, I checked on the dating website to see if maybe the number was wrong or something, but it, it was it's the right number. It doesn't matter. So, so, thanks for coming again. See you, John. Yeah, see you. You take care. I'll uh, be back. I'm sad leaving John in that mood. Wait! She texts. Her phone was broken the entire time. But she wants to meet and go for a drink. <laughs> I, I, I just thought you should know before you left. Thanks.